We're leaving Star City. Any particular reason why? Fight's over. City's safe. I think a fresh start is exactly what we need. We left Star City together so we could stop fighting. Not keep doing it. Yeah, see, uh, I know. And that was before I found out that my own damn city was falling apart. Though. I'm doing this. Yeah, you're doing it alone. I'm done fighting. And I will be too. When there's nothing left to fight for. Why are you doing this to my city? A few years ago, my wife died in front of me for trying to be a hero. The pain was so unbearable. My only escape was drugs. Finally, for the first time, since my wife died, I felt no pain. These people in pain, they need something that's gonna take them out of this world. They need something that's gonna put them back in it. How do you suppose we save this city? You can help people without destroying their lives in the process. You really believe in him, Roy? I believe we all make mistakes. And our judgment can get clouded in times whenever we're in pain. But after all, we wouldn't be much of the good guys if we didn't believe people could change. So what happens now? Someone's got to protect our home. It can't be me anymore. There's no way I can do this alone, though, Roy. You don't have to, John. Like I said, we gotta believe in people. A home pregnant. Pack your bags, boys. We're going to Gotham. I've located the criminals. They must be just some of Joker's left dogs. I don't have time to deal with this business. Damien? One second! No, no, it's all right. I'm just letting you know I'm going out for a bit. I got a couple meetings I gotta do. Oh, okay. Cool. Don't stay up too late, you hear me? Okay, bye. Attention all units, we have a 1098 near Blackgate Penitentiary. Suspect appears to be white male, about six feet tall, and appears to be wearing clown makeup. Suspect's considered armed and dangerous. This is our chance. And he'll be proud of You're not back then, kid! Oh. <laughs> Are you okay? <sighs>
No. Please, please, don't leave me. Why did you go after him? I just wanted to be like you. I didn't want you to be. Stay with me. Stay with me. Please. Uh. How the hell did you escape? Oh, a prison cell can't hold me. You should know that by now. Come on, Nats. I see it in your eyes. You want to kill me. You want to avenge that little boy of yours. What? Nothing else to say? The old-fashioned way, I guess. What? This is new. He's never run away before. Hide and seek, I guess. Patsy! Come out, come out wherever you are! I'll make a deal with you. You come out, and I'll be happy to discuss why you sent that precious little boy... ...to do a man's job. How ironic. Another boy wonder for me to kill. To think you would have learned your lesson by now. <laughs> Why so scared, little boy? <laughs> oh, well, now you want to show up, huh? Really? That arrow was infused with a neurotoxin that will temporarily paralyze your lower half. You're not going anywhere anytime soon, Joker. Oh, that's... I feel almost betrayed. I thought we were the ultimate duo. <laughs> I think we did pretty good tonight. I can't train you, Roy. What? Tonight was too much of a close call. But you said I wasn't ready. You're not. And no one ever is. Bruce, if this is about Damien... It's not. Look, you you want my advice, Roy. Hang up the hood. Give it up. It's not worth the trouble. You have a life, and this isn't for you. Do you understand? The consequence is at stake. It's too much. You need to give it up. After what happened tonight, I will not stand to see you out here another day. I'm not going to stop. I want to help people. I want to make a difference, Bruce. Even if it costs your life, Roy? Yes, even at the cost of my life. Look, I, I can't train you. But I have a friend in Star City that can. Take this. I just really don't understand. Of course. Let me guess. Arkham. Riddles again! Riddle me this, Joker. Riddle me that. I don't know. Something about Damien, probably. I don't know. The point is, he's not going to train me, so. I'm probably going to come back to Starlin. Either the night or sometimes. Come so. oh, be easy, will ya? See you soon, Thea. Thea. <laughs> Interesting. Come on! Chase!
Damn. That's a big ass house. Yeah, it is. I thought John was right behind us. He's always been a slow driver. You sure she's in Gotham, Roy? That's my guess. We have a better chance of finding her quicker with this guy's help. So, do you have any idea why he's targeting you? Ten years ago, I helped Batman take down that son of a bitch. The past is coming back to haunt me. So he wants revenge? Maybe. Why else would he go out the field? Leverage, perhaps? People would do a lot of things for revenge. Who'd you say live here again? An old friend. Let's go. This way. Why are we just standing here? Waiting on the elevator. What elevator? What the hell is that? That would be the elevator. You stay here. Make sure John knows his way. All right, fine. It's gonna take like three hours for him to get here. Damn, John. Where'd you go? Go get a fucking Big Mac or something? No idea what you got yourself into. He'll come for me. And when he do Shut up! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt you. I really didn't. I know all about your Robin Hood, his heroism. But honestly, there, looking at the time, 
It appears your little boyfriend is gonna come any time soon. Oh, the city outside is frightful, but your pain is so delightful. And you have no place to go, no. And Robin Hood's gonna bring his bow. Will it work? No. So I'm gonna take this nice and slow. <laughs> She's absolutely gonna love you. <laughs>
move this time. Sorry. I can't tell you, man. He'll kill me. You think I won't? You think I'm afraid of you? I've worked for Joker for years. He's a maniac. He's insane. And he won't hesitate to kill me or you or anybody else you love. Roy! 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 God damn it! You need to get control of yourself now! But you're running out of time. We have to go. Now. Give us the room. The only thing I wanted to do was to stop fighting Bruce. Have a normal life. Have a family. And then this happened. You know, I had a feeling that just whenever I was about to hang up the hood, something bad like this would happen. I wasn't prepared for this. Not at all. Even if you know something is coming, Roy, you're never prepared for how it's going to feel. You know, I didn't know Thea was pregnant, Bruce. For over a month. I was out there risking my life to protect my city. She was pregnant and I had absolutely no idea. She asked me to stay and not to fight and I thought it was just her being clingy, but she actually needed me, Bruce. I guess she was just scared to tell me. She needed me, and I walked away. And now I might lose my family because of that. When you came to me years ago, Roy, you asked me to help you become something better. You asked me to help you become a protector, a symbol. I thought you knew then that the idea of having a normal life was out of the question. It wasn't possible anymore. We make enemies. Roy, we do what's right when everyone else is too afraid. It's our job. And you were just doing yours. Yeah, yeah. We're going to find her, Roy. And when we do, you're going to do your job. Because that's what we do. We save lives. But you can't lose control again. One thing I've learned from all the years of fighting is that you can't let the enemy get to you. Oftentimes, they know they can't match your physical strength. So they go for something a little bit more personal they attack our hearts. A million punches can't even compare to one hit to the heart. I want to kill him, Bruce. I want to 
kill me. So do I. And I have a million reasons why. But that's exactly what he wants you to do, Roy. He wants you to lose control. He wants you to give in. But you're better than that. Yeah, no cares. Well. Oh. They say that a man that has nothing left to live for is undefeatable. I don't believe that. I believe that the man that has everything to lose is more unstoppable. Because while he's fighting for nothing, you're fighting for everything. Yeah, he may be ruthless, he may be apathetic, but you have everything on the line. <laughs> and he's got nothing else to live for. You're stronger, Roy. You are. Think about that next time you start to lose control. Uh, guys, we have a problem. What the hell is going on? I don't know. We'll fix it. I can't. In five, four, three. Oh, Holly, forget the countdown. What the hell? We're alive. Hold on. We're missing all the action. Absolutely lose my fucking mind and kill your little girlfriend. TikTok Robin Hood. <laughs> Lovely one, Mr. J. I think you've really got to him. That's the plan, Holly. That's the plan. Wait a minute. What? If he just broadcast it live, man. then that means. He has an active IP address. Which means we can trace the signal back to him. Start the command prompt. Stop the signal scan. Wait, why are we stopping the Because we don't need it. We got him. Yeah!
Oh well. It was fun while it lasted. John? I'm on it. Guys, let there be right. Do a thermal scan. Like I got here right in time. A few minutes earlier wouldn't have been so bad. So glad you could finally make it. You son of a bitch, I should kill you right now. Could, should, would. Not going to. You heroes are all the same. I literally had a beat. A young lady with a stick just to get you here. Oh, you are a hard guy to get in touch with. Uh-oh. It looks like you brought a friend. Seems like I'm outnumbered. Actually, it's you who's outnumbered. Boys! I almost forgot someone. Harley? Present, Mr. J! Now, shall we begin? Give it the case. Enough chatter. Let the games begin. <laughs>
Mine's better. <laughs> Not even close. Y'all ready for hell? Please, no. Stop. What are you doing? Stop. No, stop.
tonight we've been introduced. I'm Michael. Thea. across Gotham in case of my failure. He's not bluffing. I scanned four bombs across the city. That's that. I wouldn't do that about you. One electric shock to me and the whole city goes boom. Any ideas, Bruce? Bruce! Bruce. city explodes. Now! Before I blow this city to hell! You too, Robin Hood. On your knees. Roy. Now! Now, was that so hard? What you want, revenge? Is it because he put your ass in prison ten years ago? Pardoning me? I'm not the contrary, electric guy. I'm doing this mainly for revenge, mainly for fun, more or less fun. He's insane. Now, I beg, Roy. Now, Robin Hood. City suffers. Go to hell. Wrong answer. What? What's wrong with this? <laughs> have you done this, me and you? It was like 53rd anniversary, hmm? Hello? Feels like I'm talking to a brick wall here. Betsy! <sighs> you never talk to me anyway. 
Give me something to... Come on, give me something. Got nothing to say? Nothing? It's over, Joker. What about you guys? Nothing? Anyone? No. Just me. You know, none of you have the balls to finish the job. Something done right? You gotta do it yourself. No! Let's be honest, boy. Now is the time for you to hang up the hood for good. To flip the page and start anew. You have a family on the way. And you can't afford to lose them or yourself. You got a chance to have the life that I never could. Don't waste it. The world will always need heroes, but your family needs you more. It wasn't your fault. His death wasn't your fault. <laughs> yeah, maybe one day I'll believe that too. If you need me for anything, Roy, don't hesitate. Bruce, there is one thing. Thought I was good, I was good on my own, I was all right. John, I don't understand where we're going. And I definitely don't understand why I'm wearing this stupid dress. Girl, do you ever shut up? Thought that I knew everything, never wrong, I was all right. Oh, I was Bruce? Good, I was good. What? <laughs> What's going on? Congratulations, Thea. Congratulations for what? Yeah. Roy, <laughs> What's going on? Maybe this is the worst time to do this. When is the time ever going to be right? Thea, I know I made a lot of mistakes. And I can't change the past, but I can change right now. I've been fighting my entire life, and whenever I saw trouble, I just ran straight towards it. But not anymore. From this point forward, I promise to only run to you. I'm not going to ask a question to you, and I'm not going to get down on one knee. I love you, and I want to spend the rest of my life with you. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you.
spend the rest of my life with you two. Now I do. Now I do. You all right? Yeah. Just brought back some old memories. I never did get to thank you, Michael. You never have to, boy. You inspired me to do better. And I thank you for that. So what now? Now, I'll get justice for my wife. You deserve punishment. She deserves justice. You know, I would offer my help, no. but... You already did enough already. This is something I have to do on my own. I respect that, Mike. Good luck. I guess I won't be getting sued. How about you keep the old? Ah, uh, give me the piece of shit. It's not that bad, <laughs> right? All jokes aside, man, you've been a really good friend to me, and I don't know what I would have done without you. You've always been there whenever I needed you the most. So thank you, John, for everything. You know, Roy, I'm always just a call away. So you know, me and Thea's thinking about moving again. Again? Second time's a charm, right? <laughs> I'm happy for you. For real, man. But I am gonna miss you. But don't think of it as a goodbye. Think of it as a see you later. Until we meet again. What do you know? See you later, John. Hey, Roy! Yeah? Merry Christmas, Roy. Merry Christmas, John. See you later, buddy. Everything you know about the man that murdered your wife is on this drive, even in their current whereabouts. I don't know how to thank you, John. Just find us some of the bitches.
Beware my power. Green Lantern's life. What you looking at? You know, I haven't noticed this until today. Noticed what? You don't see it? See what? The fist! Oh. Yeah. Oh my god. What? It's gonna be another you. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is. What? What? It's not a bad thing. How is that a bad thing? For real, how is that a bad thing? I'm a great guy.
I know I haven't been here in a while. Things have been rather complicated lately. You know, I never really know what to say whenever I come here. I mean, there's not much I really can say. I never wanted you to be like me, Damien. I always wanted you to be something better. And you know, there's not a single day that goes in my mind without the thought of killing the man that did this to you. But then I realized I'm the one that did this. I'm the reason why you're here. Dad. It wasn't your fault. I know that you can't hear me. But you can't feel me. I know I wasn't always the best role model. The best father. <laughs> Oftentimes, I wish I could go back, do things differently, but I can't. You tried. I love you, son. I love you so much. And I'm sorry. Okay? I'm all right, Alfred. I'm all right. Where to now, Master Wayne? Home. Let's go home, Alfred. Mm -hmm.